What's up, y'all? It's your boy Way Too Smooth back with another food snack review. And today we trying the flaming hot cheddar and sour cream flavored ruffles. I mean, I didn't see this flavor coming. They started promoting it in like January on uh let's see, January 31st, according to their Instagram. That was the first time I seen it. Uh, so you know, today we're gonna try and see if this brings back that nostalgic classic mix that you know if you grew up in the 90s the late 90s the 80s i don't know how long the flavor's been out but i know i've been mixing sour cream and cheddar or cheddar and sour cream whichever way you want to say it and flaming hots since I was a youngin, I mean, you buy them, you know, back then it was like 25 cents for a small bag. Put it in a little plastic bag, like, you know, whatever, like pick and save or a little sandwich Ziploc bag, or whatever, crunch it up, you know, or, you know, sometimes we used to put it, like just put it in the bag and mix it back and forth, shake it up or whatever, whichever one you prefer. But I know, and if you know, like I know, that this, flavor it better be on point man and then it got lebron on the front of it like man, what you what, like what you doing lebron what you what you doing lebron you got a game coming up bro okay whatever either either way so we're gonna we're gonna try this flavor and we're gonna see what it's all about yo you know i got i got the bag right here I got the bag. I got the, uh, oh, how he over there? And he, like, what? Bro. Anyways. So, quick backstory. LeBron James is a part of a, a trio that represents the Ruffles brand that I know of, consisting of Anthony Davis, Jason Tatum of the Boston Celtics, and then it's him that completes it. Anthony Davis and Jason Tatum, they already have flavors out. I think both of theirs have flaming Hots attached to them. Jason Tatum is the flaming Hot Barbecue, and I believe Anthony Davis may be the flaming Hot Lime or something like around there. So LeBron comes out with this flavor, flaming Hot Cheddar and Sour Cream, where he uh puts his stamp on it a little autograph on the bag whatever you know i don't know if it's limited edition or limited time only but you know we're gonna give it a try I mean, this shouldn't take long so y'all ready chest pass no i'm just playing so uh so what you do? i ain't trying yet i'm not gonna cheat y'all i don't never try the product before i get on camera just so y'all know. So, um, first off, we, we do the smell test. And as I smell this, it does have that classic cheddar and, I had to stop myself from saying sour cream. Cheddar and sour cream smell, right? So, I kinda know or hopefully they're not misleading me with the smell, but this should be probably, if not, heavier on the cheese flavor than the flaming Hot. So, you know, I gotta, let me see if I can find one that's nice and representable of this bag. You know? I want y'all to see exactly what this this is kind of good so i don't know not i might take a picture might not but either way it's packed with flavor i'm gonna take this little small one that has lots of flavor on it and we're gonna go ahead and give it a try so should i eat one i'm gonna eat two just to be sure let's go
I am not. Man, dude. Y'all, y'all gotta. Don't mind me. I'm just enjoying. A perfectly good snack. I'm just enjoying a perfectly good snack. Don't mind me. Listen. Check this out. I have to stop myself from eating the whole bag. Listen, those, this, that flavor, perfect pair. I wish just a little bit more cheddar flavor to it. It brings the heat. It brings the the smell of the cheddar and sour cream. It has a little, it has a little cheese taste to it. It's not heavy on the cheese like that. Not heavy. Like it's like, but it's uh, it's like a fair amount though. Don't get me wrong. But but my my my, this snack was amazing. I'm gonna finish that bag. I'm gonna have a, a bottle of water to go next to it. You know, it is hot. But this is like, you know, like I always say, like I always say, like, does it, was was it promoted heavy? Not really. They could have did a better promotion. I'm pretty sure most of their promotion happened on NBA 2K. But this is a good, this is a good bag of, of chips. Like, I would not lie to you. Um, you know what I say. Like, share, comment, leave a comment, please. Subscribe. And go out there and try it for yourself, man. You know? Just go out there. If you see the bag, grab, come back to the channel. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you agree. Tell me if it nah, man. You you lying, bro. You big cat. You know what I mean? Whatever. I said that like an old school person. I'm young as hell. <laughs> but no, nah, man. I'm telling you, man. I'm gonna eat. I'm done. I'm done, man. The Dugar Podcast, way too smooth. Another snack review. Another episode in the books, man. Tell your fr- family. Tell your friends. Come subscribe to the channel. We're going to do way more, man. We're going to wrap it up. Start talking about life and all kinds of stuff, you know. Whatever. Maybe it's, it's you know. I'm out of here. <laughs>